Falcon 9 is carrying our upgraded Dragon vehicle uh, to low Earth orbit. In a few seconds, we'll be passing max Q, which is the moment where the vehicle will experience the highest amount of aerodynamic pressures. And we've just passed max Q. Coming up are three events in rapid succession. Again, that is main engine cutoff, stage separation, followed by second engine start on the second stage. Main engine cutoff should happen around the T plus two minute and 31 second mark. And you just saw on screen, successful main engine cutoff, uh, stage separation, and ignition of our second stage. Uh, so on screen right now, you have two different views. Uh, on the right hand side is a view of our second stage Merlin vacuum engine. Uh, on top of that second stage is our Dragon vehicle. And on the left hand side is a view from the top of our first stage looking downward. Uh, the first stage will continue its descent back towards Earth and attempt landing on our drone ship, of course I still love you, in a few minutes uh, while the second stage continues to uh, take our Dragon vehicle to low Earth orbit. If you are just joining us, this is the 21st commercial resupply mission for the International Space Station for NASA. This is also SpaceX's 24th launch this year. And just checking in with the second stage, everything seems to be looking nominal. Trajectory nominal. That engine that you see on the right hand side can produce over 220,000 pounds of thrust in a vacuum. That single engine is what is carrying Dragon to low Earth orbit right now. Deco. And we're just a few Deco. seconds away from our reentry burn on the first stage. Watch for those three Merlin engines to relight and slow the stage down. Stage one entry burn startup. And there's our entry burn. Again, that's three engines slowing the first stage down before it hits that dense part of the Earth's atmosphere. Trajectory nominal. Stage one, entry burn shut down. And we are done with the first of two burns on the first stage. The second burn, the landing burn, will happen at the T plus eight minute and 18 second mark. Uh, that second burn should last for about 25 seconds. And uh, as that burn is happening, uh, we should also be, uh, as we wait for this Stay landing burn, uh, this is gonna be our 68th attempt to recover our first stage. And we are going to be attempting to land on our drone ship in the Atlantic Ocean. Of course, I still love you. Second stage in terminal guidance. Stage one, landing burn startup. And we got audio confirmation FTS is saved. that the first stage has begun its landing burn. Everything's looking great on the second stage right now. Stage one, landing leg deploy. There's a view from our drone ship. Stage and one. Uh, Falcon 9 has landed once again. That is the 68th successful first stage recovery. Uh, this mission also marks the 100th successful flight of Falcon 9. Uh, it's also the 35th time we've landed successfully on our drone ship. Of course, I still love you. We are about 45 seconds away from Dragon separation.
Again, we are in a coast phase. Even though the engines are not on, uh, we are still coasting at pretty pretty fast pace, 27,000 kilometers per hour. And we are expecting dragon separation just a few seconds from now. Dragon separation confirmed. And there is a dragon separated from the second stage. Uh, dragon is carrying approximately 6,400 pounds of cargo to the International Space Station on this mission. We want to give a big thanks to the Range and Federal Aviation Administration for their support today. And of course, finally, thank you to everyone that has joined and tuned in for today's launch. Uh, until next time, have a great rest of your weekend.